Well, we all know that a lot of kids never graduate from high school, but do you know how much these dropouts are costing us? Coming up next, the surprising number and also the program that is helping dropouts get back into school. You know, it's really not a big surprise when we tell you that a lot of kids do drop out of high school, but do you know exactly how much it costs all of us? Thanks for staying with us. I'm Jonathan Elias. And I'm Lisa Hughes. Last year, more than 11,000 kids dropped out of school right here in Massachusetts. Tonight, Eileen Curran shows us just how much money we're losing because of high school dropouts and what some dedicated workers are doing to try to get these kids back into school. Did you finish? Did you finish school or did you graduate? Not yet. Uh, it's 10th grade. Yeah, 10th grade. Gary Chen and Jerry Lin are looking to drop back so in. Each left high school, Chen to go back to China for a time, and Lin admits he just had trouble going to school. I couldn't wake up or, like, I was late for school. So they've come here to the Boston Reconnect program to talk with outreach worker Manny Allen. You have to actually talk to them to find out why they actually dropped out, and I think that's the part that students like the most. Last year, more than 11,000 kids dropped out of high school in Massachusetts. A big personal cost to them and a huge cost to taxpayers. Dropouts are unlikely to work, they can require expensive social services, and many end up in prison. A new study says Bay State dropouts will cost the country $108 million a year. The cost to Massachusetts alone is $34 million. The ReConnect program gets them back into school and back on track. When I quit school it was bad like I couldn't find a job just ask Janice Reynoso she dropped out at 17 and with the help of reconnect dropped back in at 19 she graduated high school this past spring and is enrolled in college this fall how do you think the future looks now it looks amazing Manny Allen was the one to call Reynoso and help her get back into school. He knows firsthand what it's like. He dropped out when he was 17. Regardless of how old you are, where you at, or how bad you think you messed up, it's not too late to get back on track. Now, in the first two years, the program has helped about 300 kids drop back in, which over the course of their lifetime is expected to save taxpayers hundreds of millions of dollars. And get this, Lisa, the program's budget is $160,000 a year. Good bang for the buck. I'll say a great investment in the future for all of us. Thank you, Eileen. Reconnect, by the way, is run by the Boston Private Industry Council with help from the Boston Public Schools.